10% with our promo code J-I-G-G-Y. They have my pillow dog beds, which are absolutely amazing. We used to be able to have Milo sleep with us in bed each and every week. However, each and every day it seemed like. However, as soon as he got that my pillow dog bed from our friends over at my pillow, he sneaks out of bed when he knows it's bedtime and he heads directly to the my pillow dog bed. Get that as well as towels two sets of towels for one low price with the promo code j-i-g-g-y now in new colors over at mypillow.com check it out today it's mypillow.com put in that promo code j-i-g-g-y save up to 30 percent we've got more coming up right now here on our big broadcast Attention. Yes, indeed, we do. It is the next edition of the world-famous Cheeky Jaguar Radio Broadcast. We are coast-to-coast, border-to-border on iHeartRadio today, and we have another topical show, as they say. Our guest, hopefully, who will join us here in just a few, is Heidi St. John. She will be joining us, hopefully, to uh, discuss vaccine mandates Now, what is the big, big issue with vaccine mandates? Um, Why is this such a big deal? You've seen the story, Southwest Pilots Union says the vaccine mandate is not to blame for canceled flights, which means that it was. Um... (laughs) There is uh, COVID-19 mandates rolling out and what to know about religious exemptions, according to Good Morning America. Um, Exploring the legality of vaccine mandates. Um, Here's... Here's basically um, kind of what I think about this story. And, 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 and I'll tell you, honestly, here is, here is basically the situation, uh, much like we did with our labor union show, um, I want to just give you, as they say, the straight poop on this. Uh, Vaccine mandates and how they are supposed to work. Basically what happened here is that Joe Biden, Joe Bite Me, as Rush used to call him, Announces sweeping vaccination mandates affecting millions of workers. The administration said the new mandates could affect about 100 million people, more than two-thirds of the U.S. workforce. This was announced on September 9th. President Joe Biden issued two executive orders mandating vaccines for federal workers and contractors and announced new requirements for large employers and health care providers that he said would affect around 100 million workers. More than two-thirds of the U.S. workforce. We've been very patient, but our patience is wearing thin, Biden said. Making a direct appeal to the 80 million people who said they were still unvaccinated. Your refusal has a cost on all of us, he says. Biden also announced that he asked the Department of Labor to issue an emergency rule requiring all employers with more than 100 employees to ensure their workforce is fully vaccinated or require any unvaccinated workers to produce a negative COVID test at least once a week. The requirement could carry a $14,000 fine per violation and would affect two-thirds of the country's workforce, a senior administration official said. Employees working in health care facilities that receive Medicare or Medicaid reimbursement will also be required to be vaccinated. Biden said a move that will impact 7 million workers at $50,000 or 50,000 health care providers. As of July 27th, percent of countries... Healthcare workers were unvaccinated, according to the study of the COVID States Project. 
The administration, which shied away from the mandates early in the summer, is now embracing them as what Biden once billed as the summer of freedom. Ends with thousands of unvaccinated Americans dying from COVID-19 every week. Much of Biden's wider agenda and political standing is seen as dependent on his ability to address the pandemic with his approval numbers falling as new infections rise. So that's the news part of it. Now, I would almost assume... (laughs) I would almost assume that when we get our guest on the line, she will be down on vaccine mandates. She will give us the straight poop as far as what vaccines and what vaccine mandates are. So we will do this. We will take a break. 